The mother uh, November was busy. We got the water with the pond fertilized. We got that all done. We put in the valves in two days with our new valves. We had the water turned over to county water for, I think, 36 hours. Uh, we got it shut back on. We only had four phone calls of people worried about the water. Uh, it was after 10 o'clock. They actually forgot that we sent out a thing about it and they were very thankful. Uh, the water doing all good. The valves look good. Uh, we got uh, our lift to put up Christmas decorations. Uh, some of them needs a little bit of help, but they look good up there. Donated from Mr. Brown and his uh, business. We, plot, we, plot we appreciate that. that. Uh, another thing I want to, uh, during when we were doing the valves at night, it was like a 24 hour we worked. Uh, Mr. Brown had some of his guys out there helping shutting off valves. I want to say thank you for that. Uh, it wasn't all about me. Mr. Billy helped too. Uh, <clears throat> But we, we got a lift to put up the Christmas decorations. We also, during that time, we had the lift. We had some community service. We cut the big branches over the Civic Center that we was having problems with. We got that down with no cost of calling a tree person. We did the same thing that Saturday over the fire department. We got a big limb down, and we didn't have to call the tree department. Uh, it looks... Good. If any storms come in, I don't think there'd be no damage now. Uh, if the tree did fall uh, during this time, we've been uh, getting ready for Christmas. The Christmas tree dedication. Hopefully, we'll have a fire <coughs> to bring Santa Claus in. Uh, we need to <coughs> ask about that. Santa has really? planned plan to uh, uh, attend uh, the tree lighting, and uh, I understand he's very anxious well, to come. We're getting ready for that. Uh, see, we're putting up lights, trying to get some pine straw, maybe spruce it up the front. <coughs> uh, some community service people wants to help do that. <coughs> right now, um, trying to get up some stop signs. We got to replace some of them coming up. I got a. I think there's ten stop signs, and about four different. Uh, street signs that we got to replace to keep up in code, our state code. Uh, we're going to start cleaning stop signs, start cleaning road signs. Uh, we're getting ready for the parade. I got community service people coming in there to help with that. Outside of that, we're just on the move trying to get everything done. Cookies. We got cookies. <laughs> cookies being there. There's another thing. Uh, I have to thank Bree, you guys letting us start this community service, letting us see these people. Uh, we're getting a lot from Bob Austin, uh, probation, and another company called Sentinel. They're letting their people come and do community service here with us. Since I'm doing it every other Saturday, it's more. We had to buy, we want to have some cookies with the tree lighting and we looked at them and it would have been very expensive uh, I had an older lady who wanted to bake them if we bought the stuff for her probation she wanted to bake them so she did community service baking us 700 and I think 62 cookies so we got them it saved 40 uh, it, it cost us he's a taskmaster so uh how many did you eat? Only five. <laughs> but I got a stack that big here. Uh, but outside of that, I mean, we're going on. We, I mean, we got big plans. Start cutting grass. Start cleaning up. Uh, Jeff, I want to say that you and Billy, uh, I've 
done a remarkable job in the maintenance department. We are really lucky to have you. Uh, you see Jeff out all the time in that gear, doing the going here and doing this and doing that. And they save us a lot of money by taking down those tree limbs, like Jeff said. I mean, you're talking thousands. <laughs> you know, so Jeff, uh, you know, got those ornaments up, the, uh, the wreaths that came from uh, David Brown, our fire chief. He got them donated, uh, and they look they look really nice. And uh, we just great job. Thank, Thank you. you. Mr. Mayor, can we no. possibly change Mr. Patterson's title? Uh, myself and Chief Brown have been talking, and when we introduce him as a supervisor, we prefer to interview and, and introduce him in his official capacity, Director of Maintenance Operation, or as we like to call it, DUMO. <laughs> Do more. Jeff, great job. I appreciate it. Hey, let you guys go to do, 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 uh, Dumas, Texas. Hey. It's like you say with the meters. I, uh, I think we need to check in a little bit more we will. And about it. Uh, I mean, so that, those meters have to be bid out. I just wanted everybody to see what they were. Yes, yes. They do have to be bid out. So and, uh, we'll see how that works out. I think everything's going right. We, we push it forward. And, I appreciate it. Is there any other things that might need to be uh, brought up? Uh, still, if sits and see stuff, I'd like them to notify us where we can <coughs> try to get it done. I know there was a couple of limbs down during the Thanksgiving holidays that we flagged off and come Monday we came and got them out and I moved them out of the way. Uh, one more on that situation. Uh, when I get, I'm going to have to get a lift to get the Christmas tree ornaments down, or the, the wreaths down. But uh, I can, we can do it with a tow behind, it'd be a lot cheaper. But uh, we need to look at over on Collins and Gordon Street in front of the Baptist Church. We've got a bunch of older trees. And they hang over the road, they're on our right of way. But we need to uh, kind of take care of some of them limbs before they come crashing down. I want you guys to... If you guys are out, look at them and give me your guys to look at them. Okay. After that, appreciate it. Thank, Thank you. you. Collins and what? Collins and Gordon. Okay. Okay, moving on.